Japanese arcade convention. Oh. Where you they have all sorts <laughs> of different Gunpa, Japanese arcade cabinets from both the new age and the old. So you got all the old man stuff, you know, you got Super Turbo, Third Strike, D Sav, uh, all JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, all those old. Oh, games. I love that game. <laughs> uh, and you also got like rhythm games. You got Go! Table Flip that's gonna be there too. You also got all these different other things. It's a really really cool event. I didn't get to go there last year because it coincided with the launch of this game actually. So, <laughs> so anyway, go to Raj. It's this weekend. It's gonna be awesome. Back to the match. And already Snoopo putting up a good combo against Rave King. Now this this match is gonna be really weird because Ike. He only needs like six hits. Yeah. Uh, Fox, he needs like 15 hits. It, it's very, like, this is another matchup that I would classify as a slobber knocker. Yeah. For it's real. going to be two players where they can play passive if they want to, but you know they're going to be aggressive. <laughs> Man, there are some moments where I forget just how light Fox is. And it's it's combos like that that kind of bring you back down to reality. I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, that could probably He's end him as early as 60 if he gets the, the platform. Like if that was like a Mario or or, or a like snake. something else, a <laughs> snake or something, they'd still be living. But Fox, nah. I think no, he did not. Did, did he receive a? Uh, oh, oh my, my god, Raven King. Just Raven feeling King himself it, right like, there. Honestly, Raven, whenever Raven King feels himself, like, it's very clear to, like, yeah. he just you starts... You can see it in his movement. Oh, yeah. You see it in his movement. You see it in, in the way that he just kind of moves around the stage. You see it in his ledge trapping. You also see it in the way he goes off stage. Because, like... Oh, oh my... God. <laughs> Rage, 80%. Uh, Yumi just <laughs> putting his, holding his hands in his face because uh, he knows that pain. I feel so bad for Fox <laughs> that I have to play this match. <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, Already that half the percent needed to sucks. end his life. And Snoofle just... Okay, that back, right, back air. air. Animal enough alive. to do it. I'm trying to scope out a back air, but... Super Raven scoping King. out a lot of options. He's trying to scope out back air. He's trying to scope out up air. But Ugh. Raven King's just doing a good job of spacing himself. There's no way that he can... Well, there, right there. That was a very good workaround to that. Yeah, but then but, you have something like that. Do this box away. You might... We, we might see a switch to Wolf. But I'm not probably, sure. Probably. I'm not seeing Snoople's Wolf in a bit. But for this matchup, I wouldn't blame the switch. I know that. You I need mean, that extra weight. When you get with, when you get hit with the JB3, you gotta kind of feel like step back and like think about life for a second. You know? Like it's, it is doable. But Raven King, the way he plays, it's very, it's very passive. It's also very explosive. And Fox can't really deal with explosivity like that because especially I mean, with we, a big disjoint like we that. We saw, as well. we saw him die to that nair up air strength twice at relatively early percent for other characters, but. Snoofle sticking to his guns. Three, gonna feel this matchup two, out. One, yeah, we're gonna go. also return back to PS2. I kind of agree, because uh, I don't know what Raven King banned. Probably banned maybe FD. I wouldn't be surprised if it was FD. FD's really good for Fox. Yeah, maybe oh, so far, well. Snoofle. Woo! Turned on the off. Jets. Already got... I was looking for the carry on the nair, but Raven King now starting to mix it up with the empty hops. Yeah. It's, Snoople's going to have to start mixing up with his double jump as well, as long as he doesn't get caught. But Snoople's already a kill percent. This is just not fair. Let's trap like I said. Oh my god. We <laughs> saw Snoople go with this really great, like, 0 to 115 string at the beginning of the game. And all it took was Raven King for a second. Come on, you were right. It's literally, it's the dichotomy where Snoople has to do all this work, but Raven King is like, oh, okay. You hit me. I'll trade with you. I'm going to be winning these trades. Okay, both these players sitting up, running up in shield, and that up air almost going to kill Snoople one more time. I, I'm still surprised that Snoople's just trying to, uh, like, pressure Raven King on those platforms because the way that we've been seeing sure. Raven King takes stocks, from that kind of platform height. And it's the same area too. He does a really good job like copying 
through that platform there and starting the nair. So it literally catches all of Fox's oh, yeah. full hop jump. The way that he's dropping down there, it's covering both the ground and the platform. So there's really, you really have to respect it whenever he's in that space. And the only way around it is really kind of coming in above him. But even then, there's areas where the nair can cover his airspace as well. So. And, and Ike is blessed that it hits behind him as well. So if he really wanted to, uh, Raven can, can turn it around to extend the hitbox even more. But so Snoop was doing a really good conversion there. As long as he's able to keep edge guarding him here, get a kill, you know, it might be his time to shine and turn it around. But 70% on Snoop will just gonna watch uh, it up air. Not quite, but that go. up air is going to do it. All right, hopefully this breathes some life into Snoop rolling around at the speed of sound. Getting a triple oh, three, up there, four. four! Hit him with another one. Ooh. Falling there, dislodges him. Oh, oh no! And oh. that's the story of this. That it is so heartbreaking. Oh, I, I, I just, I'll reiterate, I just feel bad.